Okay, so let's look at the next question, guys. Here, this this question here. It's uh, again a, it's a concept of uh, just the replica of last concept. Okay, that that will give you a good um, command over this concept. This question says that Naman purchased a television which cost rupees thirteen thousand two forty. So the cost in this last video in the last question we just saw this concept here, right? So the cost here is thirteen thousand two forty. Okay. And uh, is required to pay some cash down payment. So I don't know. So let's say X rupees is the cash down payment here. Okay. So the rest will be the loan amount. So rest will be the loan or balance amount, right? Now what what he does actually at the end of one year he is paying how much? Uh, at the end of first year, so let's say he is paying rupees two seven nine four. Is given here. Okay. At the end of second year he is paying rupees uh, six two nine two. Rupees six two nine two at the end of second year, and he is paying rupees one three three one at the end of third year. So at the end of third year, he is paying rupees one three three one, right? So again, same fund will apply because all these tolerance values are given, guys. And I, I know that all whatever is the balance here, whatever is the after paying rupees six two nine two, whatever is the balance left, that balance left will increase by ten percent because it is CI, है right? ना? And this will be one three three one, correct? So why that same thing will take you will be taking you. So basically, whatever is the balance left here to that balance left to this amount, the ratio is ten is to eleven, right? The value of eleven is one three three one. That means value of one would be rupees one twenty one. That means value of ten should be rupees twelve hundred ten. Okay. So the balance amount here was rupees twelve hundred ten. Was rupees. Twelve hundred ten, right? So balance amount here was rupees twelve hundred ten, correct? That means that means the total amount if he would have cleared the loan at the end of second year only, so he didn't need to pay that ten percent extra on twelve ten. That is ten percent is one twenty one extra. The total loan would be would have been how much rupees seven five zero two. If you add it, six two nine two plus one two is one zero is seven five zero two. Okay, so let's rub this part now. Correct? Let's rub this part. Okay. So now, if he cleared the amount at the end, if he cleared the loan, if he would have cleared the loan at the end of second year only, then the cost would have been rupees seven five zero two. Sure. Now, again, had he not dragged this loan to second year, right? So had he not dragged this loan to second year, and he wanted to finish in the end of first year only, so again he is paying on the balance amount here, whatever is the balance amount here. On that balance amount, he is paying ten percent interest or ten percent interest or extra, right? So again, the what is the ratio, guys? The ratio is again ten is to eleven. So value of eleven is seven five zero two. So value of eleven is rupees seven five zero two. So value of one would have been how much here? Uh, eleven uh, six just sixty six nine zero eleven eight just and two to six eighty two. Correct. The value of one would be rupees six eighty two. The value of one is rupees six eighty two. What is the value of ten? Value of ten would be how much rupees six eight two zero. That means here he would have paid rupees six eight two zero and would have cleared his loan at the end of first year only. That six eight two zero at after uh, including ten percent interest has become seven five five zero two. So six eight zero plus two seven nine four was how much here? This if you add it, it will get rupees nine six one four nine six one four eight. That means, had he cleared his loan at the end of first year only, he would have to pay rupees nine six one four. But he didn't do that. Out of nine six one four, what he did? So out of out of nine six one four, he paid some two seven nine four, and rest was again the balance for next year. Okay. Now similarly, if I if I again move here, so again, uh, whatever is the balance amount here, so after thirteen thousand two forty. Is the price of television out of which he paid a tax of rupees X, है ना? So out of which he paid a tax, sorry, not tax, sorry, he paid a a cash down payment here of rupees X. So cash down payment of X rupees means what? So this is the balance amount here, है ना? That will be increased by ten percent. So again that ratio that will be increased by ten percent here. So again that ratio is ten is to eleven, right? Now value of eleven unit is rupees nine six one four. So value of you can write here value of eleven here is rupees nine six one four. What is the value of one unit? So eight seven four zero. Yes, eight seven four zero. 
and what is the value of uh, 10 units here okay correct no yeah 10 is rupees 87400 that means rupees 87400 was the balance amount after paying the loan correct sorry after paying the cash down payment here so now after paying the cash down payment here his balance is 87400 right so 13th uh, and I, think I put one more zero no i think sorry yes i think it is 874 it should be 8740 correct so that means uh, he has paid some 8740 and uh, 8740 correct so he has paid some 8740 out of 13240 balance is some uh, balance is 8740 so what he paid so 13240 minus 8740 huh. this is the amount he paid here right so he paid here some 4500 rupees okay so 4500 rupees is the cash down payment he made so my answer would be 47 4500 so you probably got this concept right so it's a very good concept you can solve uh, such questions on installments with great ease when you're given all the values can easily get that use the ratio method and calculate all in a chain okay chalo and also also this combat guys okay so this uh, combat uh, you know it's a very good test series it contains some good high quality questions okay so the easy questions are, are not asked here so it basically it contains only good uh, medium and high quality questions with some uh, very advanced concepts okay and uh, uh, this from this Sunday onwards it is in basically revised format so basically we are mo moving closer to cat right now so in January February and March we were like away uh, we are around eight to ten months away from cat so the questions we put off maybe some uh, easier or medium level right but this from now onwards the questions will be of higher higher level okay and uh, all the LRD assets also um this quant questions also and basically it's a fun it's fun right actually giving this is a fun because after every question you get to get, get to get your live ranking okay then uh after every question the faster you answer the better your the better your rank is right you get more points so actually the, those one hour test is a fun and actually if you look at the cat you should give uh multiple uh, sectional tests and tests before cat okay and this is one of your high quality tests absolutely free of cost and uh, now from uh, earlier it was not that rewarding but now they have introduced some uh, great rewards in this i think okay so rank one two three one year subscription i think around twenty thousand or 75 percent scholarship or 50 percent so it's a great prizes are on offer here okay so get it live from your mobile app you just put the in, uh, link here i'll uh, this uh, invite code you can put here ravi roda it ask you for invite code it is absolutely absolutely free of cost okay ask you for invite code put Ravi Roda and the link I'll put in description just enroll from there okay and do give this every Sunday do give this at 12 p.m. it's on every Sunday okay so every Sunday give this on 12 p.m. thank you